everyone, and welcome back to Friday with Friends, Challenge or Be Challenged. Now, tonight, our special guest had to cancel for medical reasons, and we hope she feels well soon, but she is the one who gave us our challenge. Our challenge tonight is to do a string or chain pull. It has to be an abstract, no floral bouquets, but other than that, no restrictions, whatever colors you want, whatever design you want. So let's get down to the table and have a little fun. Okay, today I'm gonna to be working on a 10 by 10 level three artist loft canvas. And our colors for tonight are Master's Touch Permanent Black. That's gonna be my base color. Folk Art Treasure Gold in Copper. Liquitec Basics in uh, Phalo Green. Master's Touch in Pearlized Golden Green. And Amsterdam Light Gold. So we're going very green. We are coming upon uh, St. Patrick's Day, so let's do a little fun with the green. All right, so we're gonna start, we're gonna flood this canvas, and we're gonna go from there. There's two basic ways you can do this. You can either put down a piece of paper, put the paint on the chain, and then put the chain on and pull, or you can put your paint on your canvas and then put the chain into the paint and pull. So we're going to start with that first option. So I'm gonna get myself a nice piece of wax paper. I've got my chain and we're just going to put some paint onto the chain. Make sure you clean your chain between each round because it's going to have black paint encrusted into it. You don't want the black paint ruining what you're doing. Each time I dip my chain into the paint, I roll it to make sure that all sides of the chain are getting coated. Thank you. 
my quandary. I really need something here. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to be very tricky to put something there without messing up what's around it. Okay, that's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna clean up my sides a little bit and we'll be in for wet results. Okay, we have our wet results. Oh, this is so pretty. I think this came out really good. Okay, we're gonna let this baby dry and I'll get you dry results. Okay, now when my painting dried, my phthalo green dried so dark that you can't see it anymore except when you look really closely up. If you get really close, you can tell there's a small line of green here and there where the green has just like, it's so dark it's like blended into the black. So what I did is I took my phthalo green and I added a little deco art uh, metallic in emerald to change my color a little bit, brighten it up a bit, and hopefully keep it from drying so dark you can't see it. And we're gonna experiment whether I can pull a chain on a dry canvas instead of a wet canvas. I don't know if it's gonna work at all, uh, I'm going to try in this one little corner first, and if it doesn't work, we're going to give up. But I hate to let it go without. I know it will pull some, but it may not pull the way it should. And I've got to be very careful in my placement so I don't ruin the rest of the canvas. For some reason, my chain doesn't want to go where I want it to go. 
That did not work well. I think I need to thin the paint just a wee bit. We're just experimenting here. I don't know if it's going to work.
squeeze back in a little of the green. We'll let that dry and see if it fades out again or if it stays this time. I just like having a little of that green still in there. All right, we're gonna let that dry. Okay, we have the final, final results. I did take a paintbrush to this a little bit off camera just to clean up that green a little bit more, make it look a little cleaner. I'm sort of glad that I added it back in because it really was missing something with all of that having faded into the black and not showing. It's not quite as clean as the poles with the chain, but I still love it better with the green in there. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell so you know when I upload more videos. Our special guest this week for Friday with Friends had to cancel due to health reasons, so it's just me and Janet tonight, so please follow along to Janet with Acrylic Creations by Jay Woody, who is next. Have a wonderful weekend, everyone.